Good morning afternoon, everyone. Today, we embark on a journey into the fascinating realm of artificial intelligence, commonly known as AI. At its heart, AI is all about designing systems that can mimic human-like tasks. Think about the times you've used translation apps, or perhaps when a system summarized a long article for you, that's AI at work. But as we marvel at its capabilities, it's crucial for us to remember that it has boundaries, and it's not infallible. However, not everything is as smooth as we'd like. There are moments when AI can surprise us with bizarre outputs, often called hallucinations. Why does this happen? Well, AI's learning is data-driven. It doesn't have consciousness or emotions. It lacks the gut feeling or intuition that humans possess. So, it can occasionally interpret things very differently from how we'd expect. Now, if there's one piece of advice to take away today, it's this, never put all your trust solely in AI. Think of AI as one of the many tools in a carpenter's toolkit. Just as a carpenter wouldn't use only a hammer to build a house, we shouldn't rely solely on AI for information. Diversify your sources, and always seek multiple perspectives. Here's another piece of advice, always wear your skeptic's hat. If an AI output sounds too revolutionary or just plain odd, take a moment to double check. It's like when you hear a rumor, you'd want to verify before believing it, right? The same principle applies here. Context is king. It's pivotal. Have you ever been in a situation where someone took your words out of context? It can lead to misunderstandings, right? Similarly, AI needs to understand the context of our queries. Always question if the AI's output aligns with what you're truly seeking. If an answer seems too generic, it might be missing the bigger picture. Fortunately, in today's digital age, we have a myriad of tools at our disposal. There are platforms dedicated to verifying facts and debunking myths. Also, remember the importance of sources. Primary sources give first-hand evidence, while secondary sources provide analysis or interpretation. Always aim to be well-informed and utilize the latest tools at your disposal. It's okay to question AI. In fact, I encourage it. If you're unsure about an answer, rephrase your question and ask again. By gauging the consistency of AI's answers, you can better understand its reliability. It's a bit like asking a friend the same question in different ways to see if they give the same answer. Now, let's switch gears for a moment. How about we put our newfound knowledge to the test? I have a small activity planned. You can work solo or team up with someone. I'll present some AI outputs, and your task will be to spot any inaccuracies or hallucinations. Ready? To wrap up, our journey with AI is a collaborative one. It's not about humans versus machines, but humans with machines. It's our responsibility to use AI judiciously. Remember, AI is a tool, not an oracle. As we continue to integrate AI into our lives, let's prioritize learning and adaptability. Together, we can harness the power of AI responsibly and efficiently.